this morning I was thinking, I haven't done a Q&A. I haven't done a Q&A with you guys, so. And you know what, family? Another thing I wanted to ask you guys, um, what type of content do you like? Um, are you liking the content that I'm putting out? For the most part, are you enjoying the content? In the meantime, I hope you're having a wonderful, blessed day. And don't forget, today is the day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. And I hope you do the same, okay? All right, have a good day. Peace. Let's take this show on the same road. Shit, different day. I'll be bored out my mind. Hometown of my place. So we're gonna um I asked you guys to ask me some questions that you wanted to know about me and um, you guys you did a good job first of all okay thank you everybody that told me to keep the curls I got you and thank you I mean to be honest this is a very carefree hairstyle it's not much it's, you don't really have to do much I just get the clippers and meet me meet me and diet it same with the short, with the uh, wrap. I had it down packed. I, you know, I, I'm, I'm, I wear short hair, so it's what I do. So I would, you know, I kept it all together that way too. But thank you guys. I do know that there is, um, you know, a saying about cancer with the perm and the relaxer. Shell calls it liquid crack. Um, so thank you. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and rock this for a little while longer. Um, actually, I can straighten my hair out. Um, but okay. So, moving forward, let me grab my glasses. These, by the way, are my glasses that I keep in the car. Because I have the other ones that's black frame that I wear to work. I actually have three pair. I, want, I need to get another pair. Because the purple ones, they are kind of like, they need to be updated to prescription. All right. Um, all right, so I'm going to go with Ronell. Ronell asked, are you in an area that they got flooded? or not yes or no and the answer to that is no I um I wasn't I'm not in the area we didn't flood and God is good however I did fly I was in Florida when the hurricane happened and um, the turbulence coming back from Mich Michigan stay focused the turbulence coming back from Florida it was horrible it was horrible I tell you that so um Okay, let's uh, move on next to the next question. And that is, do, 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 do. Keep the curls, Shell, I just mentioned Shell, what she said, Roberta likes the curls. Um, Roberta, you wanted me to dye my hair purple. Um, go back to the videos, last year, September 5th, my birthday, I made a mistake and dyed my hair purple. Um, Yep, first it went, at first I dyed it red by mistake, and then I panicked, I tripped out, and I'm like, oh, so I, I, I did a search, told me to go buy some green shampoo. The green shampoo turned my hair purple. I figured I'd leave it alone because I did too much to it, and it was my birthday the next day, so I had to rock the purple. It wasn't bad, it was, it, it was okay, but it wasn't, it wasn't what Tippy wanted. All right, so then we have another question from at Trey. At Trey uh, asks about past marriages. Yes, I've been married once, um, and I'm divorced, obviously. Um, and also wanted to know about dating and maintaining female relationships, female friendships. Well, I have two friends as it is right now. That's Cheryl and Shell. Uh, Cheryl is in Michigan. Shell is in Florida. Um, and yes, I do plan on getting married again. Yes, I do. To who? I don't know, but I will be getting married again. Okay, because I did, I, although I did um, take notes, I was going to try to go by the phone, but it's throwing me off. So if I don't mention your name, I'm sorry, but just know that I'm answering your questions, okay? All right. So there's one that says, good evening. I love your content, especially when you travel to other states and cities. Thank you. Thank you. Um, and I welcome, and I'm glad that you're here. I really am. I'm glad that you're enjoying the channel. Um, 
someone else said, we are enjoying the content. It made me feel homesick when you went back to your childhood home in Florida. Really enjoyed it. And I'm glad that you enjoyed it. I'm really glad that you are here and watching the videos. I'm, I'm grateful for all of you. I thank you so much. Um, hey there, Tippy. Here watching you. Here watching. You be rocking that shortcut. You look. It looks great on you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hey, Tippy. This is the day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. Amen. Amen. Um... I will be glad in it. And that, that they also said, don't get the permit. But, you know, as far as the cancer thing, and don't. Yeah. And they like my hairstyle. It fits my face. And, and be safe out here in the streets. You know I will be safe. I am covered by the almighty blood of Jesus. No weapon that is formed shall prosper against me. Mm -mm. Okay. What color is your hair naturally? Well, my hair naturally is like a dark brown, almost black. It's not jet black, but it's between dark brown and black. And I don't like it. I decided I'm going to tone it down a little. Um, I, although I do like the blonde, I'm still going to be blonde, but I'm just going to tone it down for the fall. Are you liking your new? Are you liking your job better? Well, let's just say this: I'm adjusting to my job. Um, whew, let me take the drink right quick. Ah, okay. <clears throat> when I first started, it was horrible because, you know, when you start a new job, you should do your research, right? You should know what you're getting yourself into. And I guess I was just so excited just trying to get out of Michigan so fast that I didn't even do any research. I just got the job and I was like, I'm out of here. And it happened so fast. I mean, I got the job, then I was moving. It all happened so fast. So anyway, to say that, to answer that question... It was tough because this company has only been around here in America for two years. They came from Canada. Whew. So that's a whole nother story in its own. But me being me, I got through it. I told myself, you know, listen, you know the job. You know, you know what to do. It's just that they don't have things lined up such as manual man, managers manuals and stuff like that because when I come from CubeSmart CubeSmart made sure you had everything you needed you know I, I had two big manager books with all sorts of resources places I can find help things I can do to get help this company to figure it out and that's what I had to do why are you considering van life part time I'm considering van life part-time because the freedom of being free to do what you want to do, to move when you want, how you want, pull over, park, whatever. There's no check-in and check-out time. It's your car, so you can, or your RV or your van or whatever, and you can check out whenever you want. I love that idea. It seems fun. I mean, that's why I say part-time. I don't know if I'm ready to do it full-time yet, but, you know, I'm open to it. I'm open to doing full-time van life. I need to take it slow and... I finally, I did a video where I finally got my windows up. Well, not my windows, but I got my um, covers done. So that's exciting. Um, do you want to marry? I mean, oh wait, I skipped one. Am I single? To answer that question, yes, I am single. And yes, I plan on getting married again. I just don't know when and I just don't know how. And you know, I don't have all that answers. Uh, someone says, I love your natural beauty of your own. I love I love the natural beauty of your own hair without any chemicals. Your skin is beautiful and I love your freckles. <laughs> okay, <laughs> you love my freckles. Beautiful smile. You are a natural beauty, of course. Love you, woman. And I love you back. And I love you back. Um, yes, TP, enjoy the, enjoy the content. Please don't use a relaxer. It may cause cancer. Thank you guys so much for loving me and caring for me. All right, so. Do you think you will stay in North Carolina or return someday back to Michigan? If I had the answer to that, I could tell you right now. But I, I will tell you this. Do you think you will stay in North Carolina? No. Sadly to say, family, no. I almost want to cry because I'm not liking it here. I, <laughs> I'm glad you asked that question. I don't know. Do it show on my face? Um, I'm not liking it here. Um, 
when I first got here, I was excited, right? I was excited because I made the move. I made it and I was just like, okay, um, I like my apartment. I like um, that everything is close, right? The stores, the restaurants. But I don't know what to say, but it's just different here. It's different. Um, it's been six months and I just met Shawana, but she lives in a whole nother city, like way, like an hour away from me. She lives in High Point, but I just met her. And thank you, Shawana, for inviting me for lunch and paying for it. I really gratefully appreciate that. Thank you so much. Thank you. But I just don't like it here. I'm going to be just honest with you guys. No, I will not be staying in North Carolina. Where am I going? I don't know. Um, back to Michigan. No, I miss my family tremendously. But when I get to thinking about the snow and the hawk, no, I don't want to do it. I don't want to, you know, I can deal with mild winter condition, mild weather conditions. I can deal with that. I can deal with that, but I cannot. Well, I can, but I don't want to. I don't like the snow. I don't like wearing socks. I don't like it. So I won't be going back to Michigan unless God, unless God moves me to Michigan. But no. Keep your curls. They are so cute on you. Thank you. Okay, everybody is team curls. Okay, I got you. Team curls. Team curls. Will you ever move back to Florida? Oh, God, I hope so. I hope so. Um, If you know, you know, Florida was the first choice, you know, but I couldn't get my job to transfer. So I did something like, oh, I'm going to quit my job. I'll get another job. And I did. And I will. Um, and I took that leap of faith like I always do because no matter what, I pray about it. And I believe this was a, this was a this was a good choice for me to move here and experience. Um, just don't know where I'm going from here, guys. Uh, pray for me. I, I don't have the answers to it. I don't know. I don't know, family. But I just know that I won't be staying here in North Carolina. I might as well let you know right now. Um, my lease will be up in about five months. And as we know, time go, time flies. I have a lot of things I need to do. I have to stay focused. And um, yes, I'll be moving again. Am I excited? I mean, another adventure. Tippy Explorers, another adventure. Okay, but I hate moving. You would think that I love to move because I move so much, right? But no, that's not the case. I don't love to move. I am a professional mover, though. Anyway, um, yeah. So now, uh, let's see. There's another one. Uh, hey, Tippy, fellow North Carolina content creator here. Let's see if I can find this question. Because I, I don't know. I can't even read my own handwriting. And I'm the one who wrote it down. Really, huh? All right, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Hold on, I'm trying to find this question. Okay, sorry about that. So it says, hey, Tippy, fellow North, Car fellow North Carolina content creator here, are you making any new friends or connections since moving to North Carolina? And I haven't made any new friends. Like I said, I just met Shawana, and we, we've uh, talked a couple times, and she's very nice. Like I said, I'm just like, dealing with the decisions that I made. I'm not miserable. I'm not happy. I'm not sad. I don't know what I am and I don't know where I'm going. All I know is I am simply tippy. <laughs> if that makes any sense at all, that's the, that's all I can say family. Um, thank you for supporting me. Thank you for rocking with tippy. Tippy is always all over the place. I pray one day that I level out and I just settle down. It sounds and it looks so good and it's gonna happen one day in the meantime don't forget to like comment and subscribe okay family oh and share once again family thank you for rocking with tippy thank you for the questions um i hope i was able to answer them and you know give you the answers that you were looking for or 
or whatever. But yeah, thank you so much. And um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Okay? And uh, I'll see you in the next video, family. All right, peace. Let's take this show on the road. Same shit, different day. I'll be bored. I'm